our next option of selecting elements in the DOM is get elements by tag name. And like the name already suggests, we would need to supply over here as a parameter the tag that we would want to select. So in this case, if I'm going back and if I show you that I have a an order list and then I have five list items. So if I would want to select all the list items, I would need to go back to a JavaScript. And let's say that I'm going to set it up as a variable. And I'm going to say that the variable name is going to be list. And that list is going to be equal to document. And we're going to use the method that we just learned, which is going to be get elements by tag name. And over here, we would need to write what kind of tag we would want to select. we transform it a little bit and over here if I say a better list I'm going to do the same thing I'm just going to say for each and in this case I'm going to use a shorter syntax with an arrow function and if I'm just going to say over here item 
and then we're going to do console log item so log and item now let me get rid of the semicolon over here notice over here now i get all my list items over here and you can see that the first one has a color red With, with an array and then we're going to pick what we would want to do with it and also we need to supply over here what tag name we would want to write over here and we're going to be getting all the elements that has the matching tag name 